we're going to try to do hopefully get a good mission over here the demo drops hope there are no crates on this mission which I don't see any okay so what I've got going on is I have the bomb run that'll come in I got the mission set to complete in 60 seconds have the mission completes I plan to come in it'll drop six bombs the bombs drop randomly they're not organized I'm gonna work on that and they'll attempt to clean up some of the AI as soon as the mission completes you get your respect and your pop pads but you don't get the reward the reward comes in after the bomb run to keep the vehicles from blowing up and that's what we're testing right now so I'm gonna get up in a parachute plane come in which the plane is it comes in randomly from any location on the edge of the border and flies to the mission so it could be in real fast it could be in real slow depending on the distance of travel um, currently what it does is each bomb randomly finds a place around the mission and drops. What I'm going to do in the future is rewrite it where one placeholder finds a spot and then each bomb drops randomly around that placeholder to simulate a cluster. Um, the more cycles you have, the more likely you are to die inside the mission. But the idea of, of this is not so much to kill you, but as, is, is to help with immersion and with some AI cleanup, as you just saw, that cluster of guys died, and really, where is it at? There it is. They killed a small cluster of guys, not a whole lot. The more cycles you have, the more chance it is to kill people. Another part of this bomb script is if you have, say, you're on a PvP server and you have players that are loitering around trying to ambush you as you and take your loot. The, why I have, the reason I have it spread so far is it might actually kill some of them too. So it's, there's a reason it's spread, um, but it does look a little too random. Um, and I am actually considering making an RE fire an option because that's kind of what that looks like, as somebody stated. But after the, the plane gets off the map and the mission completes, they'll have a 30 second timer and the AI will die. And then 30 seconds after, or 60 seconds after that, the uh, base items will clean up. But as soon as the mission completes, the rewards will be released to the player, and they should parachute in with this mission. Some missions, the rewards are already on the ground when you get there, so nothing parachutes in. Um, so let's just watch and see what happens. The plane is still on the map. We'll sit back here and wait. Now, the timer starts for the AI to die. Roughly 30 seconds. Now, 60 seconds from this mark, the mission cleans up.
there you go. Let's go check the crate. Yeah, there's empty spots in here because there's mods that I don't have loaded that I used when creating this mission. I'm just using this on test mission, so the only thing that's loaded is cup. But that's it in a nutshell.